After seeing the video, I must say that we are different in the way that we can do. There are some people that are extrovert or introvert that makes them both different from each other. So as a future teacher, I am a positive person who has an enthusiastic outlook on life. Well, I will love my job and I will get sense of achievement from seeing my students develop and grow as an individuals. If I can have a positive impact on their future, I feel that I am doing my job well. Our increasingly diverse and multicultural society, it's more important than ever for teachers to incorporate culturally responsive instructions in the classroom, whether the teaching is in elementary school, middle school, or high school students. And an increasing of the diverse doesn't only relate to the race and the ethnicity. Uh, it can also include the students of different religion, economic status, sexual orientation, and gender identity. And also, we include the language background. Every student is unique. In order to properly understand and promote cultural awareness, teachers need to understand all the different types of diversity they may encounter in their classrooms, including first is the race. So, in a person's genes or color can have a great impact on their experience in society. It can also impact how they view themselves and others when engaging in classrooms activities. Next is the ethnicity. So, the ethnicity is related to a person's culture and nationality. They may come from different places and have vastly different cultural beliefs and views of the world so that's me include and third is the religion it is important to understand that people have different religions or beliefs or no religious beliefs and it may impact their participations in the class next is the language while english is commonly used in american classrooms for some students it is not the language to speak at home so accommodation should be made up to help students for whom english is the second language and next is the sexual orientation a student's sexual orientation can have a great impact on how they are experiencing in the world so the teachers should understand the struggles that exist and ensure that the lesson taught in their classroom are inclusive. And lastly is the gender identity. Similar to sexual orientation, it is important to understand that each student's gender identity, how and how they would prefer to recognize it. A teacher should respect their student's identity and use preferred pronouns when interacting with their students.